Speedy Widget is one of our oldest IDX add-ons, but since the last time I made a video about it, we've had some modifications about it. So I want to show you how it works right now and give you a refresh about what the Speedy Widgets do. So the Speedy Widgets helps decrease your website's load time by resizing a widget's images. The widget is an IDX broker widget that you create on their dashboard. And over here, you have different options um, to resize it. So I have here an account um, for a website called jlprealestate.com. And I'm going to be using this um, widget as an example. I made this test widget and it's just going to be showing um, 21 properties. And when you create this widget, this is how it would look. I'm going to be opening it up on an incognito tab and take a look at how slowly these images are going to be loading. This is because we have 21 images in this widget and they're not optimized. Um, when you right click on the image and open it on a new tab, you can see it's full size. We just need this small size. So this is what the Speedy IDX widget is used for. The first thing you need is you need to have a Cloudinary account. Cloudinary is a website where you store images and this app uses Cloudinary to store images and resize them. You don't need to do anything. You just need to create the free account and then go over here on API keys and add in um, your Cloudinary cloud name, API key, and API secret. All of this is going to be on your Cloudinary dashboard when you create the free account. Once you have that, you go back to where we were before, Speedy IDX widgets, and we have five options for Speedy IDX widgets. This is the regular one. Then we have one that shows the prices in Bitcoin, one that removes duplicated listings, and use this one if you create your widget on the new IDX broker widgets. Right now I use legacy. If you use this new section, you need to use um, this option right here. Since I created the widget on legacy, as I mentioned, I'm going to be using this first um, option. And I have a drop down over here with the available widgets. And I'm logged into the same account um, I was showing you before. It's this website. And I'm going to be selecting the widget test from the drop down because that's the widget we want to optimize. Remember, it's this one. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to be actually measuring this to see how much width we need. This is done with shift command four, and we see we need about 435 approximately. I'm going to be adding 440 as the width and leave the height um, blank because when you add a width, the system automatically um, adds a corresponding height for you. And then we can add this sort by option if we want a little option at the top that allows you to sort the properties if you'd like. And then you can add a theme to it. We have another video that explains how you can add a theme to your widgets. In this case, I'm going to be focusing just on the speedy portion. So I'm not going to be adding any widget. Take a look at the widget themes video to know about the different theme options that we offer. So for now, I'm just going to do this and click on get speedy and I'm going to preview this widget and this is how it looks and if I open up the image in a new tab you can see it's actually the correct size it's not the big image that we had um, before over here it's much smaller and only the size that we need um, for the image we can actually try making this even a bit smaller see how it looks you can play with this and see how much it affects your speed so for example we can try 420, see if it looks okay. It seems to be looking fine. So that's how we're going to leave it. And we have the sort by option that we were discussing earlier over here to sort the properties by um, beds low to high, price low to high, etc. Using the speedy widget makes your widget load faster and in turn makes your website load faster. And this would make people more likely to stay on your site and continue browsing instead of leaving when things aren't loading fast enough for them. Now, it would be very easy for me to just tell you um, that this makes things faster, but instead I want to run a test to make sure that it does. What I did is I created two pages, one without the speedy widget, and one with the speedy widget. And I'm going to be running tests on this website called JT Metrics to see how fast each of these URLs are loading. So we're going to be starting with 
um, test WOS, which is test without speedy widgets. Um, and let's see what shows up. We can see we got a very bad score for this website. Um, we got an E, which is a very, very bad. 45% um, performance, 63% structure. LPC is how fast um, the largest element takes to load. And this is 3.7 seconds. And we should have 1.2 seconds or less. And we can see lots of issues um, with the website, which means it's not loading as fast as it could be. It actually takes 6.9 seconds um, for everything to be fully loaded. So now let's test um, the option with speedy widgets, which is this site. And take a look at the score that we obtained just by using speedy widgets. We now have a GT metrics grade of A, 92% performance, 84% of structure. Um, it takes 1.5 seconds to load the largest content. It's very close to the 1.2 seconds recommended. And we have a fully loaded time of two seconds compared to six seconds that we had um, before. And all of this just by using um, the Speedy Widget app on this website. Of course, there are always things that can be improved. We can try um, a smaller width, for example, or we can try having less properties on the widget and have an all results button at the bottom. There are different things that impact um, the score that we get, but just by using the Speedy Widget app, we can get a website running faster and people staying on that website for a longer time. All of these options are available for free for Realty County clients, and you get this option um, for free, even if you're not a Realty County client, you just need to sign up on idxadons.com and you can create an account for light for free and you don't need to switch to be a Realty County client. Um, you just need to have an IDX broker account. If you sign up for premium for free, you get all of the apps um, and you get unlimited themes contrary to one theme for light for free. So yes, make sure to check out the Speedy Widgets app. It's a game changer for IDX broker widgets.